the markets had a great run today, a good start to the week. Uh, and on the first day after the GST rolled in, it was uh, a 300 point salute coming in from the Sensex. Uh, we gained uh, 300 points, so a percent gain uh, closing at uh, 31,200 plus for the Nifty. Finally, managing to regain the 9,600 level and in style, uh, the Nifty managed to gain 94 points in a single session today. Uh, the gains were led by FMCG counters, uh, ITC. Uh, was up uh, at one point in time nine percent. We had uh, Bharti in Patel, Hindalco, and Aisha Motors also gaining. So FMCG metals, uh, realty, and auto stocks uh, powered the rally today. On the losing end, we saw Sipla, Kotak Mahindra Bank, NTPC, and HCL Tech amongst the losers of the day. The list of losers, of course, shorter than those gaining. Uh, of course, uh, the biggest stock um, gainer of the day was um, ITC. Uh, at close, it came off the absolute highs of the day, but the volumes have jumped on ITC and ITC had a very good run today. Uh, basically, because there's relief, the, the government has rolled back additional sets on cigarettes. Uh, and this is a big relief for ITC. The expectation is that now uh, volume growth will look up as the tax incidence could be perhaps lower on a net-net basis by nearly 6%. So, um, good day coming in uh, for ITC. The high, um, the high frequency economic data though is not looking good for the month of June. We've seen manufacturing slowing down uh, and coming to a four month low in June, mainly because of uh, weak client demand and concerns about GST. The Nikkei Manufacturing Purchasing Managers Index, the PMI index, which is tracked closely around the world, came in at 50.9. Uh, versus 51.6. Anything above 50 is still an expansion, but it's slower than what was expected. Uh, demand from overseas uh, for Indian goods remains strong.